I became a physician because I lost my mother to breast cancer when I was 16 years old, and I watched her advocate for women and particularly do so at a time when breast cancer was a controversial issue. I've always had a love for being an advocate, both at the state and national level, as well as an advocate for the patient that I'm seeing right then and there in my office. I work and live in the state of Louisiana, a state that is 50th in the nation on health outcomes, on access to care, and so many things. Part of the challenge of achieving better health to our state was that we had one in four adults who were not covered. So of course, getting adults coverage, getting them access to nutrition services, getting them access to primary and preventive care is a very important step towards achieving better health. I'm very passionate about my ability to work in communities and work to improve public health. And I love being a policymaker and a clinician, so I hope as long as they'll let me do this, I will continue to do it. I was fortunate to be selected as the very first anniversary fellow in 2009. The National Academy of Medicine is the best learning laboratory in this nation for aspiring policymakers, scientists, and clinicians. There will never be an opportunity that you will have in your life to be around such a richness of individuals who have achieved greatness in their careers. So take advantage of it. Take advantage of every minute you have. Let it change you as a person. Let it, hopefully as it did for me, change your career course in, in a better way and, and, and help you aspire to uh, having a real impact on the nation's health and nutrition.